adolescent girls face a wide range of challenges, some of which may affect their chances to complete their education, while others may compromise their sexual and reproductive health. The symposium organized for secondary school girls in the Ishein district of Oyo State is an attempt to build more confidence in them and inculcate healthy practices that could make their life more rewarding through the use of quality sanitary materials. is a menstruating. There is a part of the reproductive organ of the woman that is called cervix. It opens. Blood flow out. And if you don't use hygienic sanitary napkins, infection can also flow in. That's the facility that we are talking about. It doesn't just start in one day. It's gradual. If you use shoddy sanitary napkins, that is the cheap ones, they are cheap but deadly because at the end of the day, you may end up with secondary infertility or primary infertility and all those other ailments that I just mentioned fibroids, ovarian cysts, cervical cancer, and the Organizers of this event say the major cause of rising infertility and gynecological problems is poor sanitary hygiene. They advise these young girls to adopt healthy practices during their menstrual cycle. My desire to build strong women, strong female leaders, healthy female leaders. And we start that by helping with the menstruation hygiene because most women they, they, they imbibe negative vibes while doing their menstruation. They are not, during their menstruation, they don't have self-confidence because some smell, some, they leak, they stain. So we like to help them, teach them how not to leak, during, to stain during their menstruation. Sanitary materials were distributed to the students by wife of the Ohio State Governor, Tamuno Menini Makinde, who was special guest of Hanon, lauded the initiative, which she says we produce more healthy women. Infection is one, two. Um, the fact that it has is do is uh, is durable. You can be on it for a long time, and uh, you won't get stained. So for most of these girls. Um, Getting their uniform stained is something that will not happen easily if they use this product and uh, is also healthy for them. Stakeholders here they say they are determined to totally eradicate the feeling of shame by girls about their bodies.